The Indian Navy is planning to acquire indigenous midget submarines that will be powered by lithium-ion batteries and will carry six soldiers. After the initial prototype is approved, there are plans for the Navy to buy a few dozen such midget submarines. Indian drone company AeroArc has formed a joint venture with US-based Ghost Robotics to manufacture different types of all-terrain robots in India including the Vision 60 that will cater to both the domestic and international markets. The Indian and Vietnamese armies have started an 11-day military exercise in Vietnam, under which they will rehearse new tactics techniques and procedures. JNK Police has introduced an artificial intelligence-based facial recognition system that would help police tackle terror and criminal activities effectively. After reports that a tunnel had been discovered near the perimeter wall of the Hindon Air Base, officials have clarified that the security of Air Base remains intact. The pit has been temporarily filled with mud, and the reasons behind the hole is being investigated by the local police. The first image of AD2 Exo Atmospheric Interceptor of India's BMD Phase 2 has appeared on social media that is designed to engage and destroy intermediate-range ballistic missiles with a range of 5,500 km. The AD-1 interceptor has already been tested in November 2022, and as per latest reports, the AD-2 will start trials in early 2024, and the DRDO aims to complete testing and validation of both the AD-1 and AD-2 interceptor missiles along with 1,500 km long-range radars by 2025. The development plans also include testing and deploying the AD-2 interceptor from naval warships. The Agni-5 is a 50-ton missile, and now the DRDO has introduced a 70-ton canisterized missile system, which could be for the much-awaited Agni-6 intercontinental ballistic missile, that will have a range of 12,000 km. A newly released picture shows a big 70-ton system on a special fixture for storage and transport, and the canister also has a fake missile to mimic the real system, which also points that India might have secret underground structure with fixed ICBM launchers. One possible reason for keeping Agni-6 secret could be the fear of upsetting Western nations, so the government might be proceeding carefully to avoid diplomatic issues. Indian Air Force officials have started discussions with the Ministry of Defence to determine the future course of the 114 MRF-A tender. The Air Force might consider increasing the number of Rafale fighter jets to be manufactured locally, along with the additional 26 Rafale Marine for the Navy. Dassault Aviation has proposed to take complete ownership of Dassault Alliance Aerospace Limited and establish a fighter manufacturing facility in India for both Indian Air Force and exports, but Dassault Aviation requires a firm order commitment from the Indian Air Force before proceeding with the RAL acquisition. The Indian Navy is considering changes to its requirements for landing platform docks, with the potential for utilizing the platform for unmanned aerial vehicles and unmanned combat aerial vehicles. Recent demonstrations have shown that medium-altitude and high-altitude long-endurance UAVs can be modified to operate from aircraft carriers, due to which the Indian Navy is considering to incorporate similar modifications into its landing platform docks, as it will increase survivability, reduce operating costs, and give the ability to conduct missions in high-risk environments. Today's Top 3 Comments